I was looking at some research uh, from Kenya around the things that drive uptake for uh, technologies, especially financial. A big one is, is sports betting. So, um, like in our field of work, I think we have that pull and push dynamic. So there's times we try and push people into have a savings account, uh, use this financial product because it's going to be good for you in terms of investment. Then there are things which pull people into the ecosystem. So something like sports betting, something like social media pulls people into um, the utilization of different technologies. WhatsApp for business and mobile money obviously is something that has been um, growing quite a bit. And I would say that the uptake in rural areas is mostly uh, driven by where you're going to be getting finance coming to you. So um, before I joined uh, Flyhub, I used to work at Jumo. And in Jumo, we used to provide digital credit on uh, Airtel and on MTN. So the uptake there was quite large. Um, by the time I left, we had about 400,000 customers. In Airtel, MTN, I think after launch, it had reached about 30,000 customers within three months. And there it's, an, it's a hunger for if you're going to be receiving uh, money. So the easier it is for someone to just, you know, uh, press a few buttons, go through a USSD menu and take down credit, it's really good. But then when it gets more complicated, there will be issues around, do you understand what, how interest is being calculated? Um, for insurance, for instance, it's quite difficult because I don't think there's a direct translation of the word insurance into different local languages. So even the concept of saying, you're going to have to pay this money in case something happens. But in case the thing doesn't happen, the money has still gone. Like getting your mind around that concept is probably the barrier towards uptaking a certain service.